Hello everyone, this is Anna. Welcome to Monday's Daily Reading. Happy Memorial Day to all of you in the United States for viewing this video today. Did you enjoy the Memorial Day holiday? Using the Fairy Tarot. And then I'll be using the Fairy Guidance Oracle. Two of Wands, we'll keep it there for now, okay. <clears throat> okay. Two of Wands, you see a fairy sitting here by a fountain, she's gazing down, there's one a wand on one side, one on the other. Things are looking a little bare back here, the trees have no leaves, it's almost like she's a bit sad. Okay, she's waiting for something to happen. Um, she is experiencing a, a moment of um, limitation. Limitation because she has to have a look at something, reevaluate. Two of Wands are traditionally uh, um, a card of uh, strategy, you know, waiting for your ship to come in. Okay, so there's something that she's waiting for to come in. All right. Whether that be, you know, a job offer, um, someone from a relationship that you're wanting to reach, maybe they left, you're separated at the moment, and there's a little sense of sorrow here, but you're waiting for that person to come back in your life, okay? Um, that's just another aspect of it, so you're waiting for something, and it hasn't quite gotten there. I also would like to say that... Um, Wands are all about creative power and expression and moving things forward in action. Lots of fire. Um, but with this card, with the two of wands, I would say your fire is restricted. It's limited. Okay? So there's something about this card that's telling me that you are under a bit of restriction and limitation. Okay? Just have a think. A re uh, you know, look at things from a different aspect, a different angle. Okay? This card is the world card. All right, in the world, you know, your world right now is is telling me that, um, you know, it's, you're, you're in the state, and you're in the state for, you know, if, if I'm thinking of a day like today with the majority of the day, but this is um, a long-term type of thing, okay? The world card is associated with Saturn. Interesting because the energies of Saturn are, are about limitation, control, um, restriction, limitations. And the fairy here is looking at the fairy and the two of wands. Okay, and this is telling me that you are in a state of there's something that you're waiting to. It's it's right there. It's almost in your hands or something. You're waiting for something, but it's there's a sense of limitation. You're limited. Okay? Um, you know, like, the twos, you know, twos are, you know, you have to be flexible. Okay? You have to be flexible. And I would say, um, think about that which limits you at the moment. What is limiting you personally on the inside? What is limiting you uh, internally? I'm going to pull one more card. Huh. And here we have a king of swords. Here we have a persona. A gentleman, someone older. Um, whether it's family or friend, co-worker, boss. This is an individual who's highly intellectual and his words are measured. Very interesting. The swords, um, it is a cold suit when you think about it, but it's air, dominated by the element of air. And, you know, air and fire, 
they complement each other very well. But there's a sense of air and fire, you know, there's, there are words that can really escalate a certain type of emotional energy, okay? And that can, you know, I, I would just say that um, speaking earlier of the limitations of Saturn and control and restraint, as you're waiting for some your ship to come in, as you're waiting, um, though you're a bit sad, somber, you know, uh, you're waiting for that to come in, to come to fruition, you're waiting um, for the return of something. Um, you have to measure your words. You need to reach a level of a higher intellect, measure your words, um, so that you don't let, so that your actions don't get away from, get away from you, okay? Alright, wands are all creativity, so though your creative force at the moment, that, um, momentum is at a current halt, you know, this will give, this will afford you the opportunity Okay, because the world card is a positive po uh, card. This will afford you the opportunity to fine-tune your ideas, okay, and your mode of expression. Now we're going to, uh, yep, shuffle the Fairy Guidance Oracle by Paulina Cassidy. And yeah, I would say your, your mode of expression here. Uh, might be limited as a restraint of a sort. Um, okay. And the card we've got here is expression. Interesting interesting expression expression unleashes and empowers your inner creative energy to flow forth okay expression we just got done talking about the limitations of the creativity of the wands perhaps a creative some, your creative energy in your mode of expression and the limitations thereof and fine-tuning them so interestingly enough the limitation of the influence of the world card being the Saturn influence is telling me that uh, in order for you to unleash your expressive uh, power and your inner creative energy you must reach this level of intellect and expression of measured words okay control limit what you say okay guard what you're saying and do so immediately in order to be successful throughout your day today thank you for watching this video i hope this message reaches you in good health and abundance always bye bye